At 55, do you know about Ree Drummond's tragic life now? How does she live with her husband? Celebrity chef, cookbook author, TV star and mogul Ree Drummond's career has skyrocketed over the past decade, blossoming from her pioneer woman blog and books to her successful Food Network TV show of the same name to an expansive retail brand of products. The pioneer woman star and lad, who have been married for 27 years, traveled to Vail, Colorado. For a couple's trip, Ree and her husband Lad Drummond are taking some time for themselves. The pioneer woman star and her husband of 27 years left their Oklahoma ranch for the Colorado mountains, according to her Instagram post on Wednesday, June 5. We got away by ourselves. We may go eat dinner at 4 o'clock if we feel like it. 5 o'clock if we feel like party animals. Ja the cookbook author revealed in the caption. The Drummonds usually travel as a larger unit with their five children Alex, 26, Paige, 24, Bryce, 21, Jamar, 21, and Todd, 20, and their kids' significant others. While this vacation may be quieter than previous trips, the celebrity chef wrote that she and Lad are relishing in the downtime. Here I'm sure we're gonna find ourselves bored sometime in the next couple of days without the kids, dogs, horses, thunderstorms, garden, cattle, and life swarming around us, but for now we're gonna go with it and smile these goofy relaxed smiles, a she wrote. In the gleeful photo, they are grinning and clinking their drinks. Per usual, Re interjected with some of her light-hearted humor about Lad wanting to go on an adventurous trail in Vail, Colorado. E that said, if Lad makes me hike Berry Picker, I'm outta here. Locals call it a asterisk asterisk kicker for a reason, and I want no part of it, a she wrote. Their children might be absent from the vacation, but their daughters were sending their parents love in the comments section. E cuties. Enjoy the much-deserved Vakri time, hopefully your dahlias are still alive when you come home zanyface. A their oldest daughter, Alex, wrote. Paige added, uh have fun. Re and Lad spent one year as empty nesters after sending Todd off to University of South Dakota in January 2023. But Re recently shared that their youngest daughter has moved back to the family's ranch in Pawhuska, Oklahoma. Re wrote about Lad's a favorite cowboy, she in a blog post on May 20th and clarified, E and her name is Paige. E Paige came home in January to work on the ranch full-time. She's getting more and more experience in every aspect of ranching, from sorting cattle to weaning calves to fixing fence and water gaps to building salt boxes and a long list of other have to chores, A re wrote. A she's getting banged up, scratched, bruised, and clobbered and time will tell if she's in this for the long haul. Lad is loving having her home. Pissed. I am, too. Todd Drummond celebrated his 20th birthday. It's a throwback to the first season of Ree's cooking show. The baby of the Drummond family just celebrated his 20th birthday, which officially makes him no longer a teenager. And officially, makes the rest of us feel old. Todd Drummond celebrated his birthday with family on the ranch yesterday. And in celebrating this big milestone, big sister Alex shared a sweet photo on Instagram of Todd seated in front of his own chocolate sheet cake lit with candles. Oh, and she baked the cake herself. E happy birthday Todd, e she said. E welcome to your twenties. Longtime fans of the pioneer woman are familiar with Ree Drummond's youngest son, Todd, who was just seven years old when the show first aired on Food Network. A lot has changed since then. Todd played his last game as a high school quarterback for the Pawhuska Huskies and is now enrolled in college. But if this picture elicits a sense of deja vu, you have a good memory. This harkens all the way back to an episode of season one in which the family hosted Todd's first ever surprise birthday party. The lucky little cowboy got to eat a plate of lemon blueberry pancakes for breakfast followed by an afternoon feast of all his favorites. Macaroni and cheese, sliders with pick your own toppings, and a dessert now famously dubbed as the best chocolate sheet cake ever. It was originally her mother-in-law's recipe, but Re accidentally doubled the butter in the icing. E I guess the lesson here is, a eh, she said, j the more butter, the better. Nonetheless, it was happy accident, and it's become the go-to treat for special occasions over the years. Back in the day, Re had the kids decorate the cake themselves with colorful bits of candy and toy figurines. But, to be honest, it's not all too different from Todd's birthday version of today sprinkled with M&MS. So viewers, for the next update please subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching.